right, what's up guys? I'm going to try to get through this comparison a little bit quick. It's kind of late and I'm recording this. I'm a little bit tired. Um, but I wanted to start getting these out a little bit more often because we have the articles up. We have the versus articles here. We got a bunch of them and I'm still writing these. Um, just kind of as I get wind of comparisons that are useful to people, uh, I've been writing new ones and publishing them. But uh, this one, we're going to do Guitar Tricks versus True Fire, and I'm going to try to get through this. Uh, we're just going to kind of go through like we've been doing, and we're going to look at in the article I've already written. I'm going to use kind of as a template just to talk through. So these two programs, um, we both partner with them, or we partner with both of them, uh, I should say, just as our disclaimer, uh, but that, that really doesn't um, impact our uh, rating system. We have um, all that detail here, and we have reviews for each one for Guitar Tricks and True Fire. You can go and check those out. Those links are in the uh, video description below. Um, but, you know, I mean, we partner with them because they are really good, and we do recommend them. Uh, and we're comfortable sending people there. Uh, so if you want to check those out, there are free trial links in the description that help support us and we'll give you a chance to just check it out without any strings attached. So just to get started here, the Guitar Tricks versus True Fire, the, the general, um, I don't know, the general difference between these two, I guess I would say, is Guitar Tricks is, is more distinctly kind of a beginner's program uh, and True Fire is more kind of an advanced uh, you know, more, just, just a lot of different things that it covers, uh, but both programs have material for all skill levels. So you can't necessarily say that one is exclusive to a particular skill level, but they definitely cater in those two directions. Um, so I'll go through some of the, this article has a little bit of age on it, I wrote it last year, I have updated it a couple times. Um, <clears throat> uh, but. The, the, the main difference here uh, in, in this table, this is just kind of basic, um, just kind of like some FAQ stuff. The main difference here would be the free trial. Uh, True Fire gives you a much longer free trial, they give you 30 days. Uh, they have more lessons, they're around 40,000, where Guitar Tricks is around 11,000, and that's just because um, True Fire does their kind of their curation and their production a little bit differently. They have a bunch of different uh, teachers, as you can see down here, a bunch of different instructors, they're around 185. Um, and they'll even get popular artists like Steve Vai is on there, um, I think Phil Kage and Johnny Hilland and a handful of, I think actually Tommy Emmanuel is on there too, he has a really good course, uh, but a handful of popular um, kind of household name guitar players are on True Fire, so they have a lot more uh, input from the community, they have just a much bigger uh, base of instructors to draw from, so they end up having a lot more material. Um, they kind of the styles they cover around 20 or so. They have a little bit more uh, nuance in that department. Cover a little bit more like kind of some subgenres and some different kind of unique types of music. There, uh, they're a little bit more expensive. The monthly price they're going to have I think 29.95 a month. Um, and then their yearly price drops down to a little bit cheaper. I think it's around 150. They also have a lifetime. Uh, at one point, they had a lifetime membership, which I think was a couple thousand dollars. Uh, I don't know if that's still available anymore. Um, but the, you know, generally speaking, there's no real uh, advantages or disadvantages there for either program. I'd say True Fire is definitely the bigger one. It's definitely got a lot more uh, kind of uh, material to pick from. Uh, but let's keep going, get a little more detail here. In this section, I grade the skill level, uh, kind of the depth that each one provides, and both are pretty good in this area. As, as you uh, can see here, as I mentioned, the beginner lessons in guitar tricks are a little bit better. Um, and then as you go down, uh, or I should say as you increase in difficulty, they kind of switch, and True Fire gets to be a little bit better. Uh, guitar tricks, topical order, I talk about that a lot. Their organization is um, pretty much... Pretty much spot on. They're just they're just the best as far as like organizing their material and getting a really tight chronological learning path that's easy to follow. Uh, True Fire isn't quite as good with that because they they tend to sell more individual courses that aren't necessarily organized into a learning path. Um, but again, there there are there's not too much to complain about on either side of this uh, uh, of these two programs. They're both just really good. They they just kind of do different things. So for site design uh, and kind of structure and um, user interface, user experience, 
these these two should be uh, equal. Uh, I don't know why we used the green check card there. That's a mistake. Uh, home page and user dashboard are both good. Uh, Guitar Tree is a little bit better with navigation, uh, both inside and outside their courses. Their main menu is a little bit nicer. They maybe have a little bit more of a, m a modern design. Their, their website has gone through a couple of updates in the last few years, and they're pretty good. Um, but TrueFire is, is really solid, too. It's really nice, clean, kind of bright interface. So there's really nothing to complain about with them either. Both uh, both look really good. This is really not as lopsided as it as it came out, but kind of, kind of the navigation I think is just a little bit better for for guitar tricks. That's why this really kind of looks up, looks the way it does. And like I said, these first two for homepage and user dashboard both are really good. Uh, I wouldn't really complain about either one. Um, let's go down to the video quality, video player quality, and features. Uh, all of this just kind of washed out, right? So. The one thing I would mention is that uh, the TrueFire uses a sound slice, to, which, which I think serves their videos in, in addition to kind of like a running um, uh, sheet music kind of guitar tab, which is pretty cool. Uh, and then Guitar just has a Wistia background. Both are really good. Uh, I don't really have any complaints about either program here. Um, the, the full screen quality kind of depends on the video you're watching. But for the most part, those are really good. Again, both programs, I don't really have a lot to complain about there. Uh, and then supplemental material, that's going to be like, uh, you know, tabs and downloadable stuff, chord sheets, audio, uh, stuff like that. Uh, Guitar Tricks is um, a little bit better about getting you tabs uh, for download, whereas TrueFire is, they're, they're kind of leaning on Sound Slice to provide that sort of in the video. Um, so you don't get as much downloadable content there. It just kind of depends on the, it just kind of depends on the video. But both, both do a lot of tabs and notation. That's certainly, uh, that they're 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 pretty close in that regard. Chord diagrams both do a lot. That's that's a wash. Um, audio files, TrueFire we've noticed has a little bit more. They're more likely to have the uh, backing tracks and stuff like that. Uh, instructor interaction is a little bit uh, better in Guitar Tricks because they have a forum where their uh, instructors are decently active and you can actually go and have conversations with them, ask them questions, stuff like that. Um, TrueFire, doesn't, TrueFire doesn't really have that because they have a lot of um, outside uh, kind of guest teachers coming in. They don't, they don't have as many, or at least it's a little bit harder to get to their in-house people, which they do have, they do have, I think, roughly the same number as Guitar Tricks, you know, several active teachers that are putting out a lot of content. Uh, but most of the time, they're getting people from outside the organization to come in and do courses, like I was saying, some of the, <clears throat> like the Tommy Emanuel stuff. And obviously, he does a course, but you can't really go and talk to him. Uh, so they're not quite as good there. Uh, TrueFire is is a lot better about offering guitar profiles. So sometimes you can download those with your courses. Uh, and they both have plenty of options, so that's pretty straightforward. For song lesson section, um, Guitar Tricks is far and away better here. In fact, uh, I don't think TrueFire does a ton of licensed music. Um, it just kind of depends on the course. Uh, so if, if songs are priority for you, I say Guitar Tricks is far and away a better option. They have uh, a, over a thousand songs now in their library, and they're adding to that all the time. Like I still check, um, and they they add song lessons about as much as they add regular like you know, just educational material, um, and they just do a great job with it. So, uh, you yeah, know, definitely give the edge there to Guitar Tricks, that's something you think about. Another thing to note, and I don't think it really mentions this in the, um, yeah, there's no place to kind of point this out in these comparisons. I probably need to fix that, uh, make sure I can mention this, but I'll just point it out. The uh, TrueFire has um, all of their courses available for single download, so you pay a, a you know, a fixed fee, and then you own the course, you can download it, and you don't necessarily have to have a membership. You can do the membership thing. Like I said, that's the $30 a month price tag or $150 a year. Um, but without that, you can still get access to material by just paying for whatever course you want. Um, the, the, when you're not a member, they're going to be a little bit more expensive, but they're still not bad. Like 30, 40 bucks can get you a course, and there's a ton of material in, in most of those courses. Like I said, TrueFire is really thorough. So it just kind of depends on what you want, kind of depends on how, 
um, you know, whether you want to kind of browse around and look, look for your own thing and kind of make your own way, or if you want uh, the, the guitar tricks learning paths that are, you know, really kind of solidly plotted out for you. Um, both are really good, and like I said, we work a lot with both of them. I know a lot of the guys that work at both these companies, and they're good companies, so we recommend them. Uh, you can check out the links in the description below. If you have any questions, leave them in the comment section, and I'll do my best to hop on there and help you out. So talk to you guys soon.